Hi all, this video we are going to discuss about we have different type of bots one type one is task bot second one is meta bot and third one is intelligent quotient bot or IQ bot so what is the main difference for these three how it will work out and what are all the benefits so in, in that uh, in that cases so when we talk about task bots task bots are all about ADMX files so all the commands and lines will become under the task bots it's all about we are talking about automation anywhere so automation anywhere has three parts task bot meta bot and iq bots iq bot is a new new one that is the imp they implemented for artificial intelligence and the machine learning involved with so that is land from experience option for iq bots so when we talk about task bots it all about print and automation it best for repetitive rule based tasks that rely on structured data if you have structured data a rule based and repetitive it, you can go with task parts if you go non structured data um, or else it's not repetitive you you can't go with task parts task parts are all about the rule based things at the core of automation are task parts you can achieve 99 percentage of the tasks or else your process related things through task parts these bots, the task bots end with .atmx. These bots automated rule-based repetitive task in areas like document and administration. For example, if you have HR, claims management and procure to pay and cash management and IT services and finance and leading to immediate improvements in productivity, cost savings and error reduction. This is the most commonly used automation in your bot. So when we talk about uh, MetaBot, so what is the purpose of MetaBot? MetaBot is all about, if you have offline version, suppose you have the screenshot, your user have most secure and reliable, so they don't want to share their application with you. So in that case, if you get the screenshot of the production, so you can start with your development through MetaBots. So MetaBot simply what it will take is, it will take the, it will, completely observe the screenshots and it will we can scrap suppose you want to scrap your field id or your customer id you have to capture on it and simply you can start it with development and finish up with development using metabot metabot ends with dot m b o t m bot so when we talk about metabot it's all about dlls Suppose you have dotted DLLs, you want to include the DLLs like blue prism code stage. If you want to increase in involved the DLLs into your automation, then probably go to MetaBot. See, it facilitating scalability with next generation integration. It best for complex and scalable process. So when you talk about MetaBot, MetaBot are automation and building blocks that help you scale. They are application resilient features that any time the application updates or changes you make minimal edits to the bot itself you don't need to change like a task bots you don't need to change each and every side of there is the minimal effort and the minimal edit and those changes then automatically applied to any process utilizing this bot and it has low maintenance and easy to use metabot helps increase rp adoption it reduce downtime and ensure control over complex enterprise wide automation so usually I like this metabot because metabots are all about offline. So when we talk about the new feature, what is IQ bots, intelligent quotient bots? It continuously landing and enhancing process through automation. It best for managing through rules and processing unstructured data. If you have structured data, you can go with a task bot. If you have unstructured data, suppose what is unstructured data? Suppose you have the PDF and PDF. Uh, your PDF has more than 400 types of lines, which means um, it has to be dynamic. Whatever, uh, sometimes your name will come left left side of the first uh, corner. Sometimes your uh, uh, username will come under the bottom line or else uh, mid anywhere. So it is unstructured data. If it comes unstructured data, you can land through IQ bots. So IQ bots are the brands. Now IQ bots, they are started with the reporting systems or or is there with PDF automations. 
IQBots are the brands in automation universe RPO platform that is merging unique cognitive that they are merging with cognitive they are coming with deep planning and machine learning and 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 supervised learning as well including their IQBots it can understand the structure or unstructured data with K with ease act based on the information and land real time making it possible to fully automate the process and run them independently if you want to run them independently it will run on it there is no need of manual intervention on it and iq bot relies on supervised learning meaning that every human interactions make iq bot smarter in addition to english iq bot can extract data in spanish french and italian and german the task bars only having in english but in addition iq bot they are adding uh, other languages like spanish french because uh, next to the first 340 million people are looking at the spanish language they then then that they are making spanish as a iq bots thanks guys thanks for watching this video we can learn some more things in next video